Yo, yo, what's up, guys? Sitko here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys the newest script for Blocks Fruits for the Valentine's update. Let's get into the video, guys. This is what the script looks like. So, here, guys, just click on main, misc, and you guys have some like really random features right here. We can use all codes for two times XP, we can show items, we can server hop, teleport to first C, second C, and all of those stuff. You guys have the Christmas event, which actually ended, so we can't actually view it. And here comes the Valentine's farm, guys. You guys can see your hearts right here. You guys can open the Valentine shop. And the way you guys actually farm for hearts is you guys just need to use the farm. I'm going to show you guys in a couple of minutes. So here we can open the shop, guys. We can automatically buy hacky. We can buy swords, guns, and basically all these different items, guys. We have some ESPs as well. Player ESPs, flower ESPs. And yeah. So here, guys, we also have some troll features. We can turn on the orb for owner, for alt as well. We can like select bolt speed, max bolt speed. We can also fly with it, guys. For the next step, we have a server ID. So here we can just basically copy the server ID. I'm not sure what you guys would use this for, but you guys can use, use it. Mirage and Discord stuff. Here, guys, we can auto summon Mirage. So we can basically automatically buy a bolt and sail around the map, guys. Here we also have the config, guys, for the script. And yeah. For the next tab guys, it's going to be my favorite tab, it's the farm tab. Here you guys can automatically put points in some of the, your stats guys. So let's say I want to put points in my sword, I was like that, you guys can see my points just went down and they went in my sword. We can do a config farm. So here guys, we can auto turn on awake rays. We can automatically bring mobs, which you guys should enable for the auto farm. We can do fast attack, which you guys should enable as well. We can disable stun, we can no clip. And yeah, here you guys can also edit your farm distance, hitbox size. I would recommend the farm distance at like 8. 8 should be fine, guys. Here we can automatically like use our skills. So here, guys, we have the auto farm. We can auto farm level. So it's basically just going to do the quest, which is like most suitable for your level, guys. So as you can see, it's currently doing this quest right here. And it's actually killing these fishermen warriors. It actually got the quest automatically. Or we can automatically farm the nearest mobs. We can farm Gunmaster and Fruitmaster, guys. Here we can farm bosses as well. And yeah, you guys can also farm multiple mobs at the same time. And yeah, here we can farm C1, guys. So it basically just does what it says. We can farm and until we get the reward pink codes and stuff like that, guys. Uh, here is it's basically the same thing, except it's the second C. And here we have the third C. We have another farm guys we can try <clears throat> we can automatically pray we can auto try and look for you and stuff like that raise before guys here we have some raise before features from next step we have a raid tab guys here we can use a kill aura for the raid and we can automatically go to the next island or you guys can just fully like automatically raid using this feature here guys we can teleport to islands like npcs stuff like that and for the final tab guys we can make it so no one can see us so it's gonna actually respond me and it's gonna make it so no one can see me now we can bunny hop right here guys so it looks laggy right now but it's actually like really op because no one can actually see us we can increase walk speed and jump power guys we have some enemy features and here we have auto bounty as well and yeah that was basically it for the entire video guys if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe Thank you so much for watching guys and peace.